Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to another Team of the Week preview and this one is massive and just as well because it's going to be dropping like during Christmas time as well. But it drops tonight, but it's going to be like over uh, Christmas Day and all that good stuff. But yeah, it looks absolutely incredible. I'm going to go through it now with the players I really want to try out and a lot of people were saying Hamas Rodriguez could have easily been in it, but would we have actually had like three players from Real Madrid? Probably not, but yeah, maybe a few will be upset. Let me know your thoughts if you watched the game. Drop it in the comments, but we've got Rufier in goal. Mm, I don't really use the Liga Un that much, and if I were to go to a French goalkeeper, it would be uh, Hugo Lloris. So, yeah, he looks quite good, though. 86 diving, 89 reflex saves. Overall, a good keeper. We've got a few silvers in there. The, they're defenders. Like, I don't tend to use silver teams uh, that much anymore. It, Ever since like they brought in FIFA 16 and they changed too much with the gameplay, because back when you used to play FIFA 12, it was just simple. They didn't bring in all this other stuff that made the silver players bad, pretty much. But now you can find a few gems here and there, but those defenders just look average. So I don't think they're going to be worth picking up. We've got Verratti, though. Italian. I love to see Italian players, and I'm a fan of Verratti. Close ball control, good dribbling, keeps possession well, and he's got some awesome stats there. He's got, like, I think that's 85 or 86 passing, 88 dribbling. Uh, what I will do is I'll actually leave a link to Foothead or Footwiz in the comments for you guys to go check out these players uh, in, in more detail. We've got Mesut Ozil though. Wow, he, like, a lot of people were getting on his back saying, oh, Paye over Ozil, and then he just seems to have, just have turned up this season. Incredible player, nice dribbling, uh, good passing as well. I, I remember reviewing his, I think he has had like a couple of informs now, so I might have to pick that up to see whether or not there's uh, like a major difference between those two. Uh, Bale, look at that Bale card, man. Oh, he was one of my favorite before like so many other patches and he's gone and got himself an inform fantastic Benzema as well another inform for him Manzukic now that's a player to try out uh, you'll be seeing a video uh, later on today with uh, someone that hasn't got like a lot of pace but he was a very very good finisher and I think Manzukic is sort of similar to the player that I've uh, taken a look at probably good shot power good heading uh, we've got Jonas in there 87 dribbling what that card actually looks pretty good really good in fact so may have to pick him up and anyone interesting uh, on the bench mm, not really not really, to be honest. We've got a purple hero card, but no one really cares about them anymore because they were released. I thought they were going to release them like every single week. But yeah, overall, the Team of the Week looks awesome. Some great players to be packed. Let me know what you think of it in the comments section. If you want me to review any players like in particular, drop their names uh, down there as well. And if you are needing coins, make sure to check out FIFAUltimateTeamCoins.com to open packs to afford these players. Use the code FUJI for 20% off Christmas sales. It's awesome. Make sure to check them out. Or if you are wanting to purchase games for over the Christmas period, you can head over to G2A and use the code Fuji for a discount. But yeah, let me know if you agree or disagree. Drop a like on the video if you're excited. And yeah, I'll definitely be picking up a few of these guys. And I will see you very, very soon for a new video. Take it easy. Team out. Peace.